Once an old Gorkha outpost, Darjeeling was purchased by the East India Company in 1835 from the rulers of Sikkim, a small Buddhist kingdom sandwiched between India and Nepal. The British established a sanatorium here for the soldiers to recuperate from the duties of the empire. The climate of these hills is not only good for the soldiers but also perfect for growing tea. And it was tea which finally put Darjeeling on the world map. The new British settlement attracted clerks from Bengal, traders from Tibet and most conspicuously porters from Nepal. Today, the most common language in Darjeeling is Nepali and the migration from Nepal has never stopped. Gurkhas as the martial race is still the dominant form of representation for closing all other forms that had become possible as a new self-identity emerged with the cultural renaissance in Darjeeling and elsewhere. The region is devoid of any developmental initiative for long and thus there is limited or no scope of quality profession. The young boys like Gaurav wants to come out of these fixed images of their clan and demands an identity of their own. Hi. Uh, your name? I'm Gaurav Sundas. And you are from? I'm from Darjeeling. So, and, uh, and what are you pursuing right now? So I'm pursuing my uh, Franklin course of flight stewards. And you want to become a flight steward or into the airlines? Yes. Sir. And you also have uh, other uh, passion? Like you have some passions? Uh, yeah. So I have a passion of modeling, sir. So I came third in the Pahari Prati fashion show in 2011, sir. Uh, actually, I want to move off from this place. Uh, problems mainly is about the education. Education wise, the guys are really stubborn. They don't want to study and all, or the colleges and all. People are going to different places, to like Bangalore, Calcutta, Delhi, to study. Darjeeling is a very populated place. There, there is no space for <coughs> shopping malls or big bazaar and all. The road conditions? Roads are being made, sir. Being made, yes, sir. And what about the water problem? Yes, sir. Water problem is also the main factor, sir. Darjeeling needs to have an identity. The Shabji Shabji has to erase from, uh, from the people's mind. Darjeeling people <coughs> dress up themselves in a very high standard. People of low standard dress up really high because they, they are conscious about their looks and all. The Darjeeling Himalayan Railway was the very first hill railway in India. Like the tea and Gorkhas, the train has become indispensable part of identity and a source of employment along with tourism. But for long, the prime tourism industry has been taken over by the affluent people from the plains, leaving behind the fringe benefits to the locals like Dumalepcha and Dumasharpa, mending their lives with small jobs and frustrations. Hum yaar restaurant chalate hain. Hum vegetable momo, chow mein, aloo dum bolta hai na ya Nepali ka famous dish dish hai wo banate hain. Haan guest log aata hai, wo sab khakar khushi se jata hai. Haan dukaan hamara rent mein hai. November tak to acha chalta hai. December se February tak to thoda season kam hota hai. School band hota hai. Hamara pati hai, do bache hai. Bada ladka twelve mein. क्लास में पढ़ता है छोटा लड़का क्लास सिक्स में पढ़ता है हम मिलजुल कर काम करते हैं थोड़ा हम काम करने से हमको अच्छा लगता है उसका हस्बैंड को हेल्प करने से पहले तो इनकार कर रहा था मत करो ऐसा बोल रहा था लेकिन अच्छा चलने के वजह से वो हम अभी खुश है और बड़ा बनने का सोच रहा हूँ और मेहनत करके मैं उधर बाहर जाने के लिए प्लान नहीं हूँ रेस्टोरेंट घर में आप चाहे जहाँ भी हो कपड़ा दुकान वैसे में करेंगे बच्चे को नहीं लेके जाएंगे नहीं लेके जाएंगे बच्चे को घर में रखेंगे खराब तो लगेगा यहाँ पर तो मैं पैदा हुआ हूँ ना इसीलिए थोड़ा तकलीफ तो होगा
The DHR, like most of the Indian railways, was once a family affair. Jobs passed down from father and son, secured and respected. But now the recruitment has been centralized and with all the cutbacks, the next most secured and coveted jobs is in the army. And in Darjeeling, that means the Gorkhas. The Indian government has stopped recruitment of British Gorkha Brigade. Today, if you want to join the British Army, you have to travel to Nepal. Over the last couple of years, Darjeeling has developed a vibrant music scene thanks to a local boy winning a TV talent contest, Indian Idol. Pravash and his band Voiceless have a dream of recording their first album, Songs of Freedom and the much coveted stardom. In the miscovered Darjeeling, isolated from the rest of the world, there is a growing sense of alienation and frustration. Majority of the Gorkhas believe that an independent state of Gorkhaland will give them a better future. The main problem in Darjeeling is that youths don't have much job opportunity. Just because we don't have activities, that kind of activities, what we feel they should have been. Being a state, and we believe that if we, if we could achieve a, have a good state and we have good people to control over it, we will have more activities and more youth will not linger around, not loiter around and stick to and think about the future, stick into doing something. To live in our place and to do our job will be more easier for us to do than go in the stranger place where we don't know anyone. It will be it will take some time. It's not hard. It will take some time for us to adjust and all. हम लोग कुछ आगे बन हम लोग की इच्छा है कुछ किसी को मिशन बनाए किसी को डिजाइनर बनाए किसी को क्या बन वो हम लोग को चांस क्यों नहीं दे जब भी हम जाते हैं बाहर तो किसी जॉब के लिए जाते हैं हम लोग वहाँ जाते हैं तो बोलते हैं कि कुछ कमी है क्या कमी वो बताइए ना Amidst all this turmoil, Darjeeling gets back to its main interest, tourism. And it's an opportunity to bring the people of Darjeeling the much needed cash. Gaurav wants to become a model against the wishes of his family. Doma Sherpa is travelling to Hong Kong to settle with her sister and Voiceless trying to record their first album, Freedom, all seeking a new identity, touching life. This song is all about person who is compared to a bird. He wants to fly as high as he can, so the, but, the, but the people, society does not let that bird to fly as far as he, he or she wants to. It's all about that. It's just about a comparison between a bird and a human being. Been far away for far too long, can't stop dreaming.